Hello guys, how are you? Today I will teach you how to prepare triple column cash flow in Excel spreadsheet. Okay, so before we prepare the triple column cash flow, let's know the answer of these questions. So we have the first one what is cash book? So the cash book is a book in which receipts and payments of our money are recorded. In other words, it is a financial journal that contains all cash receipts and payments including bank deposits and withdrawals. Now the second one is what is triple column cash book? It is also known as three column cash book. It has three money column on both debit and credit side, one on each side for recording discount, cash and bank amounts. Now we have the third or last one is what are the objectives of this book? So basically this book has three objectives as to record the cash receipts and payments, to record the discounts allowed and received, to record the deposit and withdrawals of a cash by bank. Okay. Now we know the answer of uh, these questions. Now let's prepare the triple column cash book by taking an example. Okay. So this is our question as an example. I have just uh, taken these questions from somewhere to save our time. Now it's time to prepare the format of triple column cash book. So let's prepare it. Okay. I have successfully prepared okay now let's make this uh, table dynamically and functionally okay so let's start from the date so click here click here and write the so click here and write the first day of the particular month of the year okay so suppose here the date is first March 2014 and present it okay now let's format this cell from full day to month only so click here and right click of the mouse and click on format cell click on custom and click on type box Clear all these things and write the 4M and finally click on OK. All right. Now let's clear it. I have just put the date here to format uh, this cell. Okay. We will use the date after some time when we will use the questions. Okay, so for this time, let's uh, clear it. Okay, now press the entry. Okay, now click here and select from here to here, and click here and select from here to here by pressing the control key from your keyboard. Now go to the number section of home tab that is here and click on number format arrow okay now click on more number formats now click on date click on custom now click on type box and clear all these things and write the dt dash mmm from your keyboard and finally click on ok ok alright now 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 click here and write the sum function so press the alt and plus equal to button from your keyboard ok now click here and drag from here to here now press the enter key ok now, cl now click here and press the control C to copy it now click here and select these two cell. Now press the control plus B to paste it. Okay. 
similarly click here and select all these cells and press the control plus C to copy it now click here and press control plus B to paste it all right okay now it's time to make a logical function in this area okay except uh, these cells okay so so let's start from here so click here and write the function of if so press the equal to sign and write the function if uh, write the function of sum and click here and drag from here to here okay I'll press the close parenthesis press the greater sign and write the sum function and click here from here now click here and drag from here to here I press the close parenthesis then what will happen sum this minus sum this otherwise zero now press the close parenthesis and press the enter key all right now click here now press the controls plus C to copy it click here and uh, press the control plus B to paste it okay I have not uh, paste here because discount sale or column does not require violence so let's skip it okay now click here and make the function same as before so press the equal to sign and write the if function uh, you can uh, double click on it or directly you can uh, use the open parenthesis from your keyboard so press the open parenthesis okay write the song function and uh, click here and drag from here to here and press the close parenthesis Press the greater sign, uh, write the sum function, click here and drag from here to here. Now place the close parenthesis, comma, what will happen? Sum this minus sum this. Otherwise, what will happen? Zero. Now press the close parenthesis, now press the enter key. Okay. Now click here, now press the control C to copy it and click here, now uh, press the control plus B to paste it. Alright, okay, now click here and write the function of date here. So press the equal to sign, write the function of date, date, uh, double click on it. Now let's follow this argument here, so write the function of here okay and click here paste the f4 keys to absolute it okay comma write the fun uh, function of months click here or paste the f4 keys to absolute reference comma day click here and press the f4 key to absolute reference press the close parenthesis plus 30 now press the close parenthesis okay this value is the last date of each month but this value will be um, changeable because every month has not a 30 days okay now before Press the enter key. I have to uh, add some extra function. So click here and write the function of if. 
open parenthesis write the function of or open parenthesis now click here that is the uh, sale will be e19 comma e19 is greater than 0 or f19 is greater than 0 then what will happen these things otherwise otherwise blank now press the close parenthesis now press the enter key all right now click here now press the control c to copy it and click here and press the control v to paste it okay now make the function here to same as earlier so press the equal to sign write the e function and write the or function click here it's greater than zero or this is greater than zero then what will happen to by lanes cd otherwise blank and press the close parenthesis or press the enter key okay now click here and press the control c to copy it now click here and press the control v to paste it okay now let's make uh, some correction here here the condition will be by by lane cd okay i press the enter key okay now click here i press the equal to sign type the e function and click here if this is greater than if this equals to blank then blank otherwise this plus one now press the close parenthesis now press the enter key okay now click here press the equal to sign type the e function now click here if this equals to blank then blank otherwise this plus one now press the close parenthesis now press the enter key okay now click here write the uh, write the uh, press the equal to sign write the e function now click here if this equals to by by lanes cd then what will happen to by lanes bd otherwise blank now press the close parenthesis now press the enter key okay Similarly, click here, press the equal to sign, write the if function, click here, if this equals to two by lanes cd, then what will happen? By by lanes bd otherwise blank now press the close parenthesis now press the enter key okay now click here and uh, just use the reference so press the equal to sign and uh, click here now press the enter key now click here and drag from here to here similarly click here now press the equal to sign now click here now press the enter key now click here and drag from here to here okay all right okay i have successfully made the table dynamically or functionally now let's solve the problem quickly okay all right uh this section represents the, our question area i have just um, copied the question from uh, sheet two to four to see better now let's start uh, before I start to uh, calculate or solve this problem guys, I want to tell you something uh, I will uh, solve this problem based on manual accounting concept because uh, 
I know or you know this video is uh, related to the accounting and uh, this video is just computerized format of uh, manual accounting okay so you should have also the knowledge of the manual accounting otherwise you will not need this uh, book okay so keep it up and uh, try it okay now let's start so the our first uh, transaction on first march 2014 so what is this uh, cash in hand rs 1532 and balance at bank rs 18500 so this is our uh, receipt in the form of beginning amount so click here and write the date first so first march now press the tab button from your keyboard okay now write the name by lens bd how much uh, amount in terms of cash 1532 and in terms of uh, bank 18500 okay guys you can see our um, table is working good properly you can see okay now our, uh, our second transaction is that received from Salman RS 590 and allowed in discount RS 10 so this is our receipt so so click here and write the date uh, 2 March and write the name Salman and press the tab how much money 590 and discount is 10 I press enter okay guys you can see uh, this is the meaning of DRNC at uh, CR side of uh, cash book and C represents uh, coin try entry okay okay guys I have done now you can see our book is uh, successfully uh, prepared so guys it's a uh, very easy to prepare it that's all for now thanks for watching the video if you like this please hit the like button and uh, don't forget to subscribe my channel if you have any query write the query in the query or comment box below uh, thank you once again bye bye